Hello and welcome to Ready Player Dumb. We are playing Outlast. <laughs> we don't have a camera on the model. You got an air bubble in your oh. throat. Oh! <laughs> well, I'm going to explore up here. Uh, because I did all those batteries I, I found. You need your camcorder. To oh! Let's go get it! it. M.A. Larson. He is the guy. What's your brown same spot? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hopefully everything's well lit. Cause I can't see shit. This way. I'm gonna walk towards the light. There you go. Why do you think the light is the way? Suppose it is. Don't you know the light is pretty S astray? Mm -hmm. Look, no, no light. I'll walk through the bathroom and try to find more light. Like that. Doo -doo. I need my camera. I need my camera. Mr. Camera. I want my camera. Where did you fall, you rascally thing? I need my camera. <laughs> hey! Can <coughs> you see my camera? I need my camera. Yeah, I need my camera. <laughs> Damn you. <laughs> you piece of shit! Oh, there's my camera. Hi. Hey, do you see my camera anywhere? Oh, hello. When the guy. Did my camera fall in here? Sitting in the dark. Where's mm. my fucking camera? Have you seen it? Sitting in the dark. Where's my fucking camera? I have batteries. Oh boy, I feel like I'm getting lost now. What is going on over here? <gasps> the camera. Why can't I just get touch it? it? <laughs> Why can't I just touch it? Because it's a video game. Gonna make you walk around. Around what? Oh. oh, there we go. Got it. Find a way to the third floor. Can I go? Hey, hello, buddies. Nope, you gotta walk. You gotta walk away. Oh. I think you got uh, Fuck. Yeah. Hmm? No. What? Oh, it's got a ding in it. What does? Oh, camera. my camera? It's okay. Nice. Uh, okay. <laughs> oh. There you go. Okay. Uh, can I just backtrack? Yeah. I think that's what you're meant to do. Alright. Where did I come from? Uh, well, this way? Yeah. <laughs> See an option too? Oh, I don't know. The way we came down. I know I'm back tracking. I was trying not to die. Where are we going to be now? My guess. Probably gonna take you back to where you pick up your camera. I know. That's uh. Me. Corner me. Uh, they corner my bakery. There. Unhappy camera. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind us. <laughs> or so just both of these doors if you want. It's definitely stalled them a little bit. Right. Vault over. Alright. I don't think there's an option to just. Oh, 
You can't just spam the jump button around the locker. So you can't just press jump. There nope. you go. I can't. I can't do it. So it's too, too scary. Oh yeah, this is great. I'm Ooh, time to take a bath. <laughs> Mind if I do? Alright. I know that we're clean. I don't even know what floor we're on right now. Well, you just want to get back to where you were when you dropped the camera. That you're close to. Door. Man, that was a rude part of the game. Find Father Martin in the administration block. Oh, I guess I'm going that way. Gotta jump, jump, jump for your life. Did it, nailed it. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we were on the other side of that at one point. I was ready for you, asshole. I think we want to go down there and uh, Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Hi. Are you cool? I think he's cool. Are you cool? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go Only right one here. way out. Only one way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Which way? This way. I'm gonna guess he's gonna say, yeah. How do you know you're not a patient? Oh, you mother of. Did you just let me in here? Mm -hmm. How do you know you're not a patient? Sarah, how do you know you're not a patient? Uh, we came here by car. Did we though? Oh. I thought we did. Drove ourselves up here. Is this gonna take that, uh, crap, what was that? Well, I guess that would be a spoiler if I said what movie this reminds me of. Yeah. But there's a movie. I kinda operates off of this yeah. or I should say operates off of that idea the idea like that like you're you're just investigating the asylum trying to figure out what happened mm -hmm. but then it turns out you were in the asylum the whole time mm. oh <laughs> Hi, Chris. Would you move? Would you move? Would you? Oh. You turned off my camera. I think you did more than that. That's the greatest tragedy of all time. Yeah. Well, now we know our friend is here. Yay! Yay! Yeah. Christopher! You know this is not the way, Christopher. <laughs> is this literally where he shows? Wait. Yeah. What? There he is. Oh, oh. Check in that room. So let's see. I dead went down end. here. It was a dead end. Which means I was kind of screwed no matter what. Oh, to hide in here. Chris, there's nowhere to hide in here. Chris. There's nowhere to hide. This <laughs> Just 
just go. Yeah. <laughs> Chris, why are you gonna be like that? Why does he have to be so rude? Yeah, he told us to shush. Shush, 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 shush. That one? Yeah. You didn't like this one. Let's see what's in there. Oh, there's a bed. Okay. Hey. I think that's where we want to go. Had a long day at the hey. office. <laughs> hey Nathan. <laughs> How are you, Nathan? Let's, let's check Nathan out. Hello. Will you please move? <laughs> Will you move? <laughs> oh. Oh. Okay. Glad we had this discussion. Nathan is hurt. I think Nathan needs a bandage. Yeah. Let's crawl into the party. Let's go into the lobby. I'm sure Christopher will not be in here at any point. I think this is the safest thing I've ever done. Nope. How much do you want to bet? Billy's dreams. Uh, it's from Viglando. I too are you near? Patient William Hope. Hey, Cindy. Another interesting conversation with Billy this morning. He says he's been talking to Doctor Wernick again for his therapy in the White Place. I'm disturbed by the fact that his delusions have only gotten worse in medication. Uh, with medication, sorry. Uh, which isn't the literature for benzodiapine. In any case, his dead doctor friend is filling in his head with more German folklore. Apparently, the only thing that can kill the wool rider are vampiric butterflies vomited from a demon called Horskr. The butterflies suck the breath from the people's lips and <laughs> The butterflies. <gasps> the butterflies! Suck the breath from people's lips and drink blood from their nipples. They can also take form of emancipated... Emaciated upright pigs or sick dogs, so Billy's got that going for him. You'd mentioned Billy talking about his mother's tattoos before. Are there any of them by chance tattoos of butterflies? Next time I get outside of the Murkoff firewall, I'm going to look online and see if there's any actual basis. Turn page. Wait a minute. They're all called, they, they call them butterflies everywhere. Oh. It's not just a typo. Butterfee. I don't know. Uh, in German folklore, or if Billy's making this garbage up um, from whole cloth. I would love to compare notes sometime. Wouldn't mind doing it over a glass of wine, winky face. Gets lonely up here on to Kurt. Curtis. Kurt is just Kurt doing this. Just bonus. I don't know. I something tells me. Something tells me it's not. Oh, no. Something tells me that Nathan is going to show me the way. Nathan. Oh. Chris walking around. Nathan. He's still there. Just Chris walking around. Big lumbering man. 
Go back this way towards me. Okay. No, not there. Are you able to push that opener? No. Okay. And Nathan, was it pushable? No. I think he usually gives a, a button to press. Okay. I think I have to go through the hallway. Oh! Bye, Nathan. Bye, Nathan. Good call. Mm -hmm. Nathan was pushable. Nathan was a pushover in his life. Hey, we're back here. And in his death. Back here. Um, this was where we first saw those guys dead, but they disappeared. They're all gone. I'm pretty sure this was. Oh, maybe it's a different part of the area. It should be a But, like, this is like the main lobby area, it seems. Best hmm. Spirit Breach. Translated from German. Berlin, it's like September 1938. Uh, Reisler, Lawner, and Dr. Med Rogue? Raj? I have pressing news concerning the ongoing work for Dr. Rudolf Wernick and his development of the morphogenic engine, expanding on theories developed with his brief but unfortunate relationship with A. Turing. If I had not witnessed it myself, I would not believe it had happened. But beyond given the promise in cellular regeneration and guided uh, cancer regeneration, I believe Wernick's method has breached the spiritual realm, something crossed from the other side. I personally witnessed the appearance of an apparition, briefly but undeniably so. Please forward my note and invitation to witness further experiments uh, to Dietrich uh, Eckert. I do not doubt that the Fur Fuhrer himself may uh, have been may need to be made aware of our discoveries. It is my opinion that Dr. Wernick's successes represent an enormous opportunity for our cause and the German people, and are obviously sufficient reasons to keep him out of any sort of culling program. program. Regards to your family, signature illegible. He was not eligible to send in his signature. Mm -hmm. <coughs> yeah, this, this is the main lobby area. Mm -hmm. This is where Chris, we first saw Chris, and he threw us down those, in that area. Can we go through that door? Let's see, we saw that. Righty. This is the first part of the game. Uh, we want to find him in the administration block. around real quick yeah all right we need to find a key i think he just told us somewhat where it was i was paying Option. attention i need a key i think we were paying attention to more where is this key man that's talking to us hey billiards this place ain't so bad after hey. i think i could live in this place yeah just Got billiards that's all you need yeah happy billiards happy wife you want me to go down here? Yeah. Crazy? It seems like the place to go. Are you crazy? Crazy. Crazy. Crazy old Marie. Feeling mm -hmm. so lonely. Alright, let's go up that ladder and we'll see what's up with that ladder. Let's, let's get in there. Mm, crazy. Crazy for feeling this way. I guess I go down here. There you go, shuffle across. Shuffle. Crazy. Crazy for them not putting a gate here. Mm -hmm. They really wanted to keep me out. <laughs> I think they wanted to bring me in. That's what I think, my dear. I hope oh, hi. Nice playing. Yeah. Yes. 
No. <laughs> no. It's like you've interrupted my peace. In a peace. In inner a peace. In 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 inner inner peace. Inner peace. Morphogenic Engine. Reported December 27th, 1985 in Los Alamos, New Mexico. Clearance Sierra Alpha. Subject, Dr. Rudolph Wernicke, 14866. Wernicke. The hips are rear. Uh, there was no alteration to the footage at all, no trickery? None. In June of 1943, you recorded three instances of spontaneous bleeding. Uh, half a dozen test subjects began to develop brain tumors? Yes. The autopsies revealed that the tumors were pure lead. It killed them? Can you explain why the results could not be reproduced in the United States? I have my theories. My homeland in those years. It's impossible to understand the things we felt, what we believe. The overwhelming fear, ecstatic rage, and English birds are insufficient. More than hope. A human mind in that environment is capable of extraordinary things. You're saying the experiment needed... A proximity to death. To overwhelming madness. Only a test subject who had witnessed an horror was capable of activating the engine. Do you believe your test subjects achieved something supernatural? No. You think that they contacted something supernatural? Nothing is supernatural. Then what was it? You said Project Wallrider was a gateway. A gateway to what? A gateway to what? Uh, I guess he declined to say. That was rude. I didn't feel like I did that. Yeah. Let's zoom in. <laughs> well, do you have something to say about it? The man sounds like Dr. Strange Lives Anemic Brother. It's a 25 year old audio recording. An interview with this Dr. Wernicke. Los Alamos uh, means government work. Wernicke talks about spontaneous bleeding, tumors, psychosomatic reactions, and sufficiently disturbed people. He seems to walk a line between science and Nazi mysticism. Only a test subject who had witnessed enough horror was capable of activating the engine, the morphogenic engine. The engine, the movie they're projecting, it gets in my head like a song. You can't stop humming. I blink and I see Rorschach tests that look like swarming insects and infect surgery wounds. The patients talk about using the engine to conjure the wall rider. It's buzzing, uh, it's the buzzing I hear in my bones. Bones. Me bones. Me bones. These guys are just trying to have some lunch or something. Yeah. And then they done dud. Alright. This must be where you do the morning announcements. Yeah. Uh, well, I'm going to door. Huh? Door to the behind it. This, oh. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Hey. Oh, oh, okay. Have fun. He says we need to find him. Yeah. Why? Right. Our job. Guys. 
Yeah, Spiderweb. Spiderweb. Spider-Man. Oh, classic document. A classic document. A classified document. I wish they sorted them the other way. <laughs> Subject, are you flesh-eating bacteria? <laughs> Wash those hands regularly, winky face. Uh, and then that was replying to necrotizing facilitis. Really? I fucking quit. Okay. I have an idea. Uh, uh, crunch. Uh, Hello. 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 Better way. Better Better Damn you, piece of shit. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? Why would you do that? He made my tope. Spasm and cramp. Oh, did it? Did that <laughs> cramp you up? There we go. Cramp. Ew. I don't know where to go from here. Yeah. Where do I go from here? The door's locked? Yeah. Oh. It seems to be. <laughs> bless you, bless you. Well, I guess we can figure that out on next time I'm ready to play. Um. Yeah. Yeah. You think this was a save point? Uh, you can manually save. Oh, in this one? Yeah. Oh, nice. All right. Well, folks, when we come back, we... Oh. Oh. Woo! the key. We got a good one. Damn you, guy. Is this the guy who did it? No. Is this the security guy? He's like, I'm watching the key. Yeah. All right. When yeah. we come back... And we'll get in there and get the key. Yes.